Hi, I'm Dr. Bumi and let's talk about car seat safety today. Um, being secure in the car is extremely important. Uh, so let's go over some basic rules. Number one, 12 years old and younger must sit in the back seat, uh, preferably in the middle if possible, um, <clears throat> because the front airbags can kill our young children. Number two, make sure that our children are secure in a car seat or belted with every single ride, no matter how short it is. Three, um, make sure that we're installing these car seats properly, which means anchoring them, reading the manual, and even reaching out to child passenger safety techs. And those you can find in your local fire stations or children's hospital. Next, making sure that the straps are fit properly, which means that the straps are snug, not too tight, uh, and in a five-point harness, we wanna make sure that the shoulder belts go over the shoulders, both shoulders, uh, and it goes over the both hips, and it clicks in between the thigh, and the chest clip is at armpit level. Now, in our rear-facing car seats, we want to make sure that the shoulder straps are coming out either at shoulder level or right below. And in our forward-facing car seats, those shoulder straps should be coming out at shoulder level or just above. Now, next is picking the right car seat. Um, it is dependent on age, weight, and height. So first, between birth and two years old, at least two years old, uh, you have to be rear facing. So you could start off with a carrier car seat uh, and as a child outgrows that um, by height and weight, you can go to the convertible car seat but still should be rear facing. Now, once they outgrow uh, that and they are at least two years old, then you can turn the car seat forward facing and they need to be in the forward facing car seat at least until five years old and it should be the five point harness car seat. Now once they outgrow that, then the next option is a booster seat. Now booster seats can still be in the five point harness or you can opt to do the belt positioning booster. Now the belt positioning booster, um, you have to make sure that the belt fits properly. Uh, and how do you know the belt fits properly? The shoulder belt goes over the shoulder, mid chest. It does not go up to the neck or the face or behind the shoulder. Um, and the lap belt goes over the thighs, not the stomach. Now remember, um, all the belts are different in every vehicle. And so test your child out um, in all the vehicles that you guys are using to make sure that the belt fits properly. Now, of course, um, of usually by the age of nine to 12, they might be outgrowing the booster seat and then they can go straight into a regular seat belt. Again, long as the seat belt positioning is, um, as we talked about, properly fitting. <clears throat> now, lastly, uh, as usual, uh, please be a good example and buckle up every time you're in the car with your children. So let's follow these few tips and let's keep our kids safe as possible. And I thank you again for listening and we will talk to you next week.